So this is a broader view in Shela, Guatemala again. <laughs> um, two more volunteers. Can you introduce yourselves too? Um, I'm Mia Fermenti and I'm from Santa Cruz, California. Yeah, I'm Delaney Puslik and I'm from Santa Cruz, California. Okay. And um, how long were you in Shela for? About seven days. Yeah, seven days in Shela. Yeah, okay. And where have you volunteered this week? Um, we volunteered at the daycare in the mornings and then at night we volunteered in a clinic. Okay, and tell me a little bit like what you did there. Um, in the daycare we helped feed the kids and kind of take care of them and pretty much just play with them and like entertain them in a way and yeah. And then in the clinic we mostly just observed and some days we went in with doctors while they did consultations but then some of the times you're just watching basically everything that's happening. Yeah. All right. And do you have like a favorite memory of this week, uh, one of the projects? Um, probably the kids get really attached to you and it's really sweet because they kind of like, they're not really nonchalant about you being there. They kind of like need you in a way or they're kind of like really sweet and dependent on you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the kids because it makes you feel like you're actually making a difference even though you're just hanging out with them. Yeah. But they have a lot of fun so it makes you feel good about it. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> and tell me a little bit about your host family. Where did you stay and how was it? How was your room? Um, they were super nice and our rooms were all really clean and nice and she like gave us fresh water every day and made super good meals. Yeah. Um, really good cook <laughs> and we liked our room a lot the like shared room it was great yeah they're really welcoming yeah and how nice. about family members how were with who did, did you live and... um yeah the whole family was super nice they live with like two daughters and one of the parents is mom so there's a lot of people but they're all super nice and friendly and welcoming and they help you with Spanish, which is nice because nobody else here really speaks English. <laughs> and they're always helping you out and giving you tips on like new things about Shayla and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And um, did you explore Shayla a little bit in your free time? Uh, yeah. Well, we got lost a couple times, <laughs> so then we explored because we were lost, which was perfect. We went to a market, yeah. and then it started raining. Oh, you made a trip on Sunday, right? Yeah, and so that was really fun, and you get to experience new things. It's kind of... Yeah, we went to the hot springs here, and those were really, really fun. There was a lot of people, but it was really pretty. Mm -hmm. yeah. The drive is just really as pretty, pretty as the hot springs, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, and, well, why did you choose the broad review, and um, how did you feel they supported you with volunteering abroad? Um, well, really my mom took care of all the scheduling with like who we chose, but while we've been here and everything, they've been super helpful and like anything we need, we can just call them and they pretty much help us. Yeah, I didn't really choose it, but I'm glad we chose it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. And would you recommend it to future volunteers even like of your age? Um, yeah, it's really fun and a great experience. I feel like people our age could even come do this on their own maybe because you get so much help and support from the people here, so mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Um, do you have any tips for volunteers who come to Sheila, like what to do or where to go, what to bring? Um, well, if you are with a family, try all the food because it's actually really good even if you might not be um, you're afraid. Yeah. And bring more. Yeah, clothes for if it's cold out because you think it's going to be really hot, but then it's not actually that hot. Well, I'd say bring clothes for both because <laughs> the temperature really Well, yeah, varies. but you think Guatemala and then you think hot, but it's a lot of temperatures. <laughs> and it does rain here. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. And what will you miss most here in Chile from or from Guatemala in general? Probably seeing the kids every yeah. day and also... The Shayla Pond is really <laughs> yeah. good. <laughs> yeah. The kids. pastries and the <laughs> kids and bread. Coffee. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Good. Okay. Looking yeah. forward to Antigua? Yes. yes. A lot. All right. Yeah. Well, thanks for a great week and have a good trip. Yeah. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Okay. <laughs>